Okay, I'm about to show you a piece of technology that I absolutely guarantee you'll be telling all your mates about around the water cooler tomorrow at work. Ladies and gentlemen, prepare to see a boat the like of which you've never seen. This is the Inner Space Dolphin, possibly the most incredible boat ever built. It's powered by a 110 horsepower engine with a canopy from an F-16 fighter. The main body is made of fiberglass and Kevlar. The bulletproof material that weight for weight is five times stronger than steel. So why does it have to be so strong? Why build a boat that's really strong, really light, has oodles of power and looks like a dolphin? Because it's intended to be the most exciting submersible in the world. The makers hope it will eventually spawn a special dolphin racing series. It uses its innate buoyancy, forward momentum and controllable flippers to do tricks like this. We'll involve barrel rolls like that. I'm going to be the first UK journalist ever and one of only a handful of people in the world to drive it. <laughs> My aim was to pull some tricks, like Rob, the designer and test pilot, but he's been driving this since he built it, and I'd only got a few hours to learn, let alone show off. Because of the way the dolphin's designed, because it's got so much natural buoyancy, um, depending on what I do, if I do some extreme moves, it should right itself. At least that's the theory. Well, I certainly hope so, because this thing is notoriously difficult to drive. I was extremely nervous. But stupidly, that didn't stop me from nailing it at full speed on my first attempt, which was exactly what I've been told not to do. To make matters worse, I tried to roll it. OK. <laughs> but it was no laughing matter. OK, we've, we've stopped on the shore. I was supposed to stay a long way away from the shoreline. The guys weren't happy with me at all. Once you can keep it level yeah. and do your turns, by all means, we can get into rolls, but, we'll try but that to was dangerous. We'll try further. Let's try to head towards the okay. bridge this yeah. time. Yeah, understood. Let's just yeah. ease it back a bit. Yeah. I had to rein myself in if I was going to keep the crew on side. This is not easy. The whole thing is a complicated mix of speed, angle of attack and fluid dynamics, and I was having problems picking it up. Let's keep drifting to the right the whole time. I needed to check in for more advice. So I find it very hard to uh, not go to the right. You weren't going fast enough to get it into right. a decent turn. Right. I'd been wary of my earlier near miss and had been holding back. With Rob's blessing, though, it was time to pick up the pace. That feels good. Slowly but surely, I got to grips with the controls. I added more power and got the hang of turning. I felt ready for more. I think I really have it now. You did real good but on it. But it's really getting there now, isn't it? Yeah. The, yeah. the movement. Your grades just improved from an F to a D. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good start, but it was time to try a dive. Let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. I headed off again with a renewed sense of porpoise. Oh! <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> that wasn't right. I went down. And then I came straight back up backwards. That's not what you want to do. The dolphin can hit 30 miles an hour on the surface and an incredible 20 miles an hour underwater. But it shouldn't go too deep and can stay under for only 20 seconds before the engine floods and cuts out. I repeatedly went too deep and once again I'd managed to worry the owners with my antics. <laughs> oh, all right. Man, that was a tight one. All right, you got two more shots at it. No. The engine's starting to get a little wet in there, so uh, what we want to do is get a nice dive, get it under, trim it out, and come skyrocketing nose first. I was at serious risk of damaging this unique machine, and I'd only got two more attempts before they kicked me out. Here we go, try again. I had to make them count, otherwise the whole day would be a failure. I'd done it, and it felt great, but there was no way I was going to stop there. They were calling me in, but I had one last thing I wanted to do. One more, one more. The barrel roll that got me into trouble earlier was now potentially within my grasp. I had to give it a shot. Okay. Yeah, Jason! That was your bad boy right there. That was your move. That's what I've been trying to do. 
Oh, yes! Oh, oh. just jaw-droppingly spectacular to watch, but it did look very difficult to control. Oh, I'm really pleased you said that, because it was, I reckon, the most technically challenging thing I've ever driven. Really, was yeah. it? But that must have made the sense of achievement all the greater at the end, Better when you got that little barrel roll. Awesome. Absolutely fantastic. <gasps> I want to have a go. Now, there's always...